everybody and welcome back to another action figure review. Today we're going to take a look at the Mythic Legions Vitus figure here, recently released in the All Stars 4 way. Vitus here was one of the first figures released by the Four Horsemen, um, but he was released again in the All Star wave here based on the votes from all the fans of the Mythic Legions. But let's take a look at the figure and what he comes with. So a bit uncharacteristic for the Mythic Legions. We don't have a lot of accessories here. We have this spear and we have one of the typical belts here that you can put on the figure. And we have over here a nice shield with a symbol. And then he has the sword here in his hand. So that's really it. You don't get any pauldrons or exchangeable heads or daggers or whatever we usually get with most of the Mythic Legion's figures. So we basically have this Spartan looking gladiator type figure. And the figure itself looks really good, but we don't have a lot of accessories. If we move in a little closer, I think we have a great looking armor on the figure. The helmet here looks really cool, shiny armor, and as usual, great sculpt here on the hands with visible muscles and veins. We don't get any extra hands, so you have two gripping hands here on the figure, but we get the soft plastic armor here so you can articulate the figure without hindrances. And down here, the solid boots that you can balance the figure on and the angle articulation is also good. So nothing to complain about here. I think it's a great looking character. And as I just mentioned, the articulation is what you typically get from the Mythic Legion's figures, which means that it's not over articulated. For example, you only get the single jointed arms and also knees here, but you get a functional and good articulation. So you can pose the figures in typical action and museum poses. And here we have Vitus next to another figure from the All-Star Wave here, Tibias the undead skeleton character here. And as usual with the Mythic Legions, the scale is perfect. And beats us next to another figure in the same scale. Here we have the Mesco Silent Screamers Nosferatu figure. But for now, I'm going to leave you with my opinion about the Vitus, and then I'll conclude this review. If you are a fan of the Mythic Legion's figures, I definitely recommend to check out Vitus here if you haven't got him already. You might be a bit disappointed with the amount of accessories, but other than that, I think it's a great looking figure, a great looking character, and uh, I'm happy to have him in my collection. Thanks a lot for watching this review. Leave a comment and subscribe if you would like to see more.